the winning. It's just like throwing money away. Well. So I don't know. He made the announcement yesterday, and that's I that. guess if you got it like okay. that. And then people in much of the South and Northeast are still dealing with the aftermath of the destructive storms that struck on Tuesday and Wednesday. Meanwhile, in the Midwest, they are dealing with over a foot of snow. The South had heavy rains and flooding and several tornadoes. Strong winds and heavy rains also hit parts of the Mid-Atlantic from New Jersey all the way up to Maine. New York State had about 110,000 homes still lacking power yesterday. The National Weather Service is warning of more stormy weather in parts of the South, Midwest, and also the Mid-Atlantic by the end of the week. Mm. All right, so be safe out there. Then Alaska Airlines, they canceled hundreds of scheduled flights and they grounded about 20% of its fleet to carry out safety inspections of its Boeing 737 MAX 9 jets. Last Friday night, a component broke loose and blew a hole in the side of one of the jets mid-flight. Mm. The jet made an emergency landing in Portland, Oregon. Thank God no serious injuries were reported. Wow. I can't even imagine. The videos are trending on TikTok and it's just crazy to see. Yeah. Mm. So scary. And then 20 million Americans, they signed up for health care coverage through the government program known as Obamacare. That is a third consecutive annual record for the program, formerly called the Affordable Care Act. The program allows self-insured and uninsured people to sign up for health insurance and subsidizes part or all of the payments of those with lower incomes. So that's great news. Yes. And then here locally, Mardella Middle and high school were on high alert on Wednesday after police say that a series of bomb threats were made what? in an attempt to get a student out of school for the day. Stop it. Can you believe it? According to the Wicomico County Sheriff's Office, the incident occurred on Wednesday, January the 10th, when Mardella Middle and high school experienced a series of bomb threats. The administration promptly took action and... After investigating, you know, they were able to identify and apprehend a suspect, according to police. That's crazy. It's a shame. Any word on who? Just a shame. I mean, not uh, a name, no, but I mean, like. it doesn't release any of that information. Did another um, kid trying to get somebody out? I don't or? have that information, but it says wow. if you have any information, and if you know any more details, you can call the Wicomico County Sheriff's Office at 410-548-4898. So it appears that they're still investigating. A bomb threat to get a kid out of school. Yeah wrong with people speaking of mardella there was a story up on eastern shore undercover yesterday that i shared up on the power facebook page uh school bus crash in mardella springs again eastern shore undercover and i shared it up I on our facebook page has a picture um a bus was involved mm -hmm. in a crash in mardella springs it went off the roadway into flooded waters mm -hmm. so it says thankfully you know there weren't a lot of injuries but if you look at these pictures here look at that i'm showing jess off the air here but that's wild. I mean, look, look, they're like in the water. It's up to almost yeah. up to his knees. I know. Wow. Man, this kid's had an adventure yesterday. So scary. Somebody wrote up there. That's why I keep my kids home. So scary. That's why I don't even send them. So. Really? Wild. And there <laughs> yeah. are. You don't. There are some delays. Yeah. You don't send them. And that's why CPS be showing up at your house. <laughs> uh, there are some delays due to, you know, this sitting, the sitting water and the floods and, you know, some roadways still closed and all that. And we posted them up on our Power Facebook mm -hmm. pages and the Bill and Jessica pages as yeah, well. Yeah, there's so. a few closings, a few delays. But stay safe. Yes. Stay safe. Stay safe and play safe. There's um, a few signs out. It says water ahead in the roadway. And then I see the car in front of me. I mean, they just nailed it. And the water went. They fly through, huh? Everywhere. I was like, nope. That person walking on nope, the sidewalk loves me. it. Not me. <laughs> Didn't somebody who worked here, like, float through? Oh, God. Did, didn't that happen before? Somebody who worked here, like, thought they could gun it Bill. and, like, started floating through. Bill. And their car turned Bill. into a boat. Bill. <laughs> I'm just asking. Oh, was it somebody like higher than us <laughs> I sh that I shouldn't be talking about? <laughs> they thought they were driving a boat. Oh my gosh! They learned there ain't no pontoons on this oh one. <laughs> my oh my goodness! Oh my goodness!
<laughs> yeah, don't go through the water, guys. No. Throwback Thursday. We got sports on the way.